Hi, I'm Steve Jones and I'm going to tell you why chlorophyll appears to be green. Now, it's not just why chlorophyll appears to be green, which is important, but why anything appears to be green. In fact, why anything appears to be any colour is important. And so, first of all, I'm going to explain why things appear to be the colour they are. And then you'll know why a leaf appears to be green. First of all, light is not white. We know it's a mixture of colours, and you've all seen the experiment with a prism where you project onto the wall a spectrum. And the spectrum goes from red at one end to blue at the other. And from that spectrum, we can cut it into three rough areas, and those three rough areas we call primary colours, and they are red, green, and blue. Notice red, green, and blue, and this is different from paints, so be careful. These are the basic primary colours of light. Now, therefore, here I've got three surfaces. I've got a blue surface, I've got a green surface, and I've got a red surface. Let's look at the blue surface first. Here are my three colours of primary colours of light. Here they are coming in. So this is white light because there's red, green, and blue. But when it hits a blue surface, or a surface we see as blue, it's because the blue light gets to us, which means that the blue light is not absorbed. So the red light is absorbed in the surface, the green light is absorbed in the surface, but the blue light is reflected. That's why it looks blue. Let's go to the red surface next. Here's the red surface, right? We've still got red, blue and green light coming into the surface, the red this time is reflected, and the surface looks red. The blue light is absorbed, the green light is absorbed. Now let's go and have a look at our leaf. Our leaf is green. Here's our green leaf, a green surface. And it's a green surface because the red light that comes in, this is white light, remember? It's white, so it contains all three of the primary colours. So the red light is absorbed, the blue light also is absorbed, but the green light is reflected. This is our green surface. This is our leaf. This is our chlorophyll in the leaf. And this is why chlorophyll appears to be green.